So, I need to figure out how to notch this tube at this angle. It's a pretty simple one, but I'm just going to show you how I do it real quick. Okay, so I'm going to line this up roughly where I need it on the top and the bottom. So, I need that roughly right there. And I want the bottom roughly right here. Okay, so I got that zeroed out on the subframe right here. And now, you'll take, then take the angle finder, and I'm going to put it right there on the tube, and it's still right where I want it, 41 degrees, I'll probably call that 40 degrees on the notcher. Okay, I got the tube in the notcher, and we are at zero right now, you move it to 40 degrees, and that's what the notcher said, let's lose. Okay, so I got it set up in the notcher here. Got it notched, got it cleaned up. Let's test fit it and measure for the other side. So first, the same as before, we're gonna turn this on, make sure it's zeroed out on this plane. All right, so now I'm just gonna put it right here because I want it right there in the middle. So that says 31.9 degrees. So I'll probably just put that on the saw and do 30 degrees. It'll be fine. All right, so I'm just gonna take a measurement from where I want the end of the tube and where the corner of the tube is going to sit up here. And so, looks like about 26 inches. So we took this angle and that was about 30 degrees. So make a mark at 26 inches and cut it at 30 degrees. Okay, so got that marked out to 30 degrees. I put a little 30 degree angle on there just to kind of help me know that that's right. Right where I want to cut it. All right, so before you cut this angle, Make sure that you have this notched angle at a 45, or sorry, 90 degree angle. So when you put it in there, it's straight. Got that angle cut, and we got the notch side done. We gotta do the same thing for the other side and weld them in.